Yo, what's going on everyone? It's your boy D. Lloyd. So terrible news for Isaiah Thomas and I truly do feel bad for the guy. He will be having surgery on that injured hip. So he will be done for the rest of the season and the surgery is not going to be invasive, minimally invasive procedure. And the whole process of it is basically just to clean up all the joints of all the inflammatory debris and stuff like that, that they had. But the injury is still from last season's injury with the Boston Celtics and he's going to have an extended rehab period which means he will likely be done for the rest well for sure the rest of this season but he'll also probably be out for a little bit of the off season as well and that's definitely going to impact the future of Isaiah Thomas so if he's going to be out of commission for a while now you know he is heading into free agency there has been mutual interest between both parties the Lakers and Isaiah Thomas and then possibly re-signing him and bringing them back but we already know a lot of that is going to come down to whether or not the Lakers could successfully land LeBron James or Paul George. If they're able to land both of those guys, I don't see any way Isaiah Thomas comes back. If they're able to land one of those guys, if Isaiah Thomas takes a hometown discount essentially, yes, you could probably bring him back as well. And that probably be more only if Paul George comes as opposed to LeBron James. So I don't really see a scenario where all three of them will end up playing in LA but the Lakers you know if they strike out they miss on both Paul George and LeBron James yes the Lakers are now going to be aggressively trying to sign one year contract pay him a ton of money come in for one year and a lot of people are going to come because you could probably offer Isaiah Thomas way more than any other team will offer Isaiah Thomas for just a one year prove it type of deal and then go from there and see where he is in his rehab status after the next season but he will be going through surgery like I said it's definitely sad because this guy was just ready to get over a hundred million dollar contract just last summer and now he's not going to sign anywhere near that i'll be surprised if he signs anything over 20 million dollars but we'll see what happens um, like i said he's going through his surgery he'll be out for the rest of this season which is only nine more games with the lakers but then we'll see how you know where the interest is going, going to be after this season but you guys let me know where do you guys think isaiah thomas will end at the end of the offseason will he be back in l.a or will he be somewhere else, maybe on a longer term deal? You guys let me know how you guys feel about this in the comment section below. It's your boy D. Lloyd. Let me see you next time. Peace.